Welcome to V Newsletter, produced by the editorial team that brings you the music and sound retailer. I'm Jill Nicolini. We all know the fourth quarter is the most important one for any retailer, so here's hoping it's starting off strong. We have the skinny on an awesome new initiative from ADJ. Sabian's giving its loyal customers the power to choose. Plus, the founder and president of Astarope is crisscrossing the country, and the retailer was in attendance for Experience PRS this past September. Let's get started. The great guys at ADJ are offering a learning experience to dealers as well as DJs and other end users nationwide, all at no cost. It's all part of ADJ on tour. It's a multi-city, coast-to-coast educational swing that'll provide hands-on training in numerous topics, from video mapping and mixing to wireless and DMX lighting. Plus, there'll be in-depth insights into the company's next generation of products and impressive program light shows. And we can't forget the debut of two hotly anticipated series, the 2R series and the DOT series. For the third year in a row, Sabian's asking drummers around the world to help decide which new models the cymbal maker will release next year. Yes, Sabian's cymbal vote is back. Multiple sets of 12 new cymbal models developed by Sabian have been shipped to drum shops around the world. So, drummers can play before they vote. At many events, Sabian artists will be on location to perform. The Symbol Vote website also features videos of Sabian artists playing and discussing the 12 symbols. The final four will be announced at the 2014 NAMM show. Check it all out at SymbolVote.com. And we'll be right back with some new cool products coming up next. Once again, PV Electronics revolutionizes the modeling amp industry. Introducing the world's first variable instrument performance amplifier, the Viper VIP. The Viper VIP series contains innovative technology to create the most diverse and best sounding modeling amplifiers available. Whether you are an electric, acoustic, or bass guitar player, you owe it to yourself to experience the PV Viper VIP series today. I've been known to have powers of persuasion, and so has Mod Kit's Do It Yourself. The Persuader Deluxe uses a Darlington preamp to push cascaded triode vacuum tubes into distortion. Four dual triode vacuum tubes are included with each kit. They can be swapped to create a wide assortment of tones. The tones range from just a hint of breakup to over-the-top crunchy distortion. You can switch out the different tubes, choosing your own tone. A blue switch provides way more flexibility. Alfred's basic rock guitar method provides a completely new approach to learning guitar for students who want to play in the rock style. By starting on the six string, students are immediately able to play riffs and licks that inspire guitarists to continue learning to have fun doing it. The book features clear, well-paced instruction and large photographs of proper fingerings and technique. Plus, a DVD and CD have been created to supplement the material in this method. The team at Mapex designed the Rebel line to start beginning drummers off right. These drum sets are outfitted with double brace hardware, a set of cymbals that includes a ride and a pair of hi-hats, a throne and a pair of sticks. The drums have a mix of specifications including fully adjustable tom mounts, telescoping bass drum spurs and triple flang hoops. Rebel shells are made of popular for strong full tone. Rebel kits are available in three setups. When we come back, we'll give you the scoop on why Darius Rad from Astarope is currently on a nationwide tour. Plus, we have some major acquisition news from the guys at Presonus. There's a very artistic element to this show that you don't see really any place else, and that's what gives it the vibe of being so cool. At the end of Thursday, it felt like a successful show. Yeah, the rest of this weekend has been uh, almost the icing on the cake. It's been fantastic. We've been approached by enthusiasts and owners, retailers from all over the world. We've had a great buzz in the booth the entire weekend. The first day of the show, we wrote more business than we did all last, all the whole weekend last year. It's been a great, it's been a great show for us. 
I, I don't see how we could miss it. Uh, you know, I think it's uh, absolutely a necessity. But the most important thing is to meet people, meet retailers, meet manufacturers, meet distributors, and that's the great thing about NEM because NEM is really the kickoff of the year. Astrop's begun a nationwide tour to let music retailers experience its audio cables firsthand. Dealers nationwide will have the opportunity to meet Darius Rad, the company's founder and president, and get a personal demo of Astarope's audio cable technology. The company's working with Fishman, its worldwide distribution partner. Rad's already completed the first four legs of the tour, covering locations spanning from the southwest, central, and southeastern U.S., as well as the Pacific Northwest. Rad said, quote, I'm excited to be personally meeting with these dealers learning more about their needs and expectations. Presonus has acquired the assets of Notion Music, a developer of Music Notion software. Notion Music's products include the Notion 4.0 composition software, Notion for iPad, Progression 2.0 guitar tab editing software, and Progression for iPad. Presonus CEO Jim Mack said, quote, we will, of course, continue to develop and sell all of Notion Music's current products. He added, quote, and at the same time, there are powerful natural synergies between Notion and our Studio One DAW, so it's reasonable to expect that all PreSonus customers will see additional benefits from this acquisition in the future. And of course, we'll keep our eye out. These next products have been the buzz among retailers. All right, here's an example of Made in America quality. St. Blues Guitar Workshops launched the dual P90 version of the Mississippi Blues Master Juke Joint series of guitars. The series offers St. Blues customers an entry point for a high quality Made in Memphis guitar. The Juke Joint series consists of three models, the Blues Master, the Mississippi Blues Master, and the legendary bass. Series models are unbound and finished in a crystal satin finish. That differs from the high-end workshop series, which are double-bound and finished in nitrocellulose. I'm moving to the beat of Yamaha drums, and the latest innovation is their DTX 502 series electronic drums. Now, the new series, which includes the DTX 522, 532, and the 562, offers familiar kit configurations. But if you take a closer look, you'll find improved sound quality, expressive playability, and user-friendly functionality. It boasts twice the wave ROM of its predecessor, plus features like cymbal muting and natural swells. And there are eight training functions that challenge you no matter your current skill level. Galaxy Audio's products are out of this world. All right, who writes this stuff? Vinny? Yes. Of course it's Vinny. The company's CR12 and CR15 two-way loudspeakers are available in either black or white and feature a rotatable asymmetrical horn. They also boast 20 integrated M8 threaded suspension points and an integrated handle in the rear of the speaker. These units are pole mountable, ensuring that they're portable. The CR18 subwoofer is a black cabinet with a single 18-inch driver. It has integrated handles and features a built-in pole mount. Okay, right after the break, we'll have our top stories, plus we've got a report about last month's hugely successful experience PRS event, and it's almost time for the Oscars of our industry once again. Make sure you stay tuned. Hi, I'm Yul Jabara, CEO of Galaxy Audio. Our family business has grown into much more than hotspots. This year we celebrate our 35th anniversary. Check out our very popular lightweight headset mics, wireless microphones, and wireless personal monitors. Experience PRS, now in its seventh year, continues to grow, having become an annual destination for those in the MI industry. The event was held this year on September 20th and 21st at PRS Guitars Manufacturing Facility in Stevensville, Maryland. It brought together authorized PRS dealers and distributors, press, artists, and customers, plus enthusiasts. The event attracted almost 3,000 attendees this year, including Dan Farisi, who's editor of the Music and Sound Retailer. This year's event marked the first time PRS opened its doors to highlight the new S2 manufacturing line. According to our man Dan, Experience PRS was an event to remember. 
Yes, believe it or not, it's that time of year again. It's time for the Music and Sound Awards now marking its 28th year. Wow, that really is something. If you've already received your copy of the retailer for this month, then you've seen the nomination ballots we've enclosed, as well as a four-year consideration list of products that are eligible to be nominated. Of course, we can nominate other eligible products that aren't listed there. Be sure to return your ballot, though, by November 1st. Next, we'll be asking you to vote for the winners, and awards will be handed out at the NAM show. And that's it for this edition of e-newsletter, but be sure to watch your inboxes because I'll be back in just two weeks. Again, I'm Jill Nicolini, and as always, we all thank you for watching. Have a great day, or night, or morning. Bye-bye.